Hi, it's Tim here from How You Do It, my Google channel. This is the first in a series of videos that I want to publish about uh, how to get a lot of productivity out of your iPhone. Uh, this is my new iPhone, my second one. Unbelievable device compared to the first one that I had. Um, so useful, in fact, that I would have to say this is almost my primary computer. I use it more than my other two computers. So um, anyway, in this video, we're going to talk about how to set up Google Calendars on your phone so that it synchronizes in real time at any time with your real Google, Google Calendar. All right, so let's get started. So here we are on the home screen of my iPhone 4S. And what we're going to do is add the Google Calendar and Google Contacts onto the, onto the device. And uh, so the way we start is we go to Settings and we'll go to Mail, Contacts and Calendars. And you'll see an Add Account. So we will add an account. And then we go to Microsoft Exchange. And then we fill out all of these fields. So remember that it is, it, it is essential to have a Google Gmail account before we can run through this procedure. So if you haven't got a Gmail account, very simple to set up. Just go to Google's homepage and set up your account from there. All right, so now on to the next step. Okay, now we're in the next screen in this procedure and it will again ask you for your email address and your password. The most important part to remember is you need m.google.com to be your server name. And the domain name you can leave blank, put your username in here, your Google username or your complete Google email address and then your password. So it does ask for that information twice and uh, then you click next and the check marks go through and then you can see you can either uh, all three of these services are available now for real-time syncing calendars contacts and mail uh, and I'm gonna turn the mail off because I have my usual email that I'm gonna be using so but <clears throat> if you don't have if you don't have email on your phone yet you could always add your Gmail by doing it this way as well then you click uh, save and you're all done Okay, I've loaded my calendar and it looks like everything's there. Okay, so it all worked. Um, I've got all my calendar items here and it looks like, let me just check my contacts. All my contacts are in place as well. And I uh, pulled them straight off my live Google account. So I hope you found this video tutorial useful and please uh, feel free to leave a comment and uh, Subscribe to my video channel and you'll see plenty more videos coming your way.